I'm Travis Corte. I'm a policy analyst who can code. What I bring is, I think, the enthusiasm of someone who knows how important it is for PDFs to get liberated and also some of the tools to help liberate them. A PDF is an is a image format that a lot of organizations use to store um, documents. We have to work with these PDFs because that's what, that's what the government has. They're not necessarily on the cutting edge. They're saying, well, here's the format that we've been using since, you know, 1993. This is going to be, uh, this is what you get. I think this just sort of happens as the as technologies progress. Is um, we we haven't necessarily thought of um, how a technology that works in the present is is maybe going to fail in the future. That's what a lot of, of civic hacking is for me. Is um, uh, saying okay, well here's the world that we've inherited. Um, how can we make it more like the one that we want? Rather than saying you know um, rather than expecting people from previous generations to have already thought of all of our problems. We took a uh, document from the San Francisco City Ordinance. I don't know exactly the contents of it, um, and we uh, ran it through a tool called um, uh, called Tesseract. And once we had tuned it to a level that we were satisfied with, we ran it and um, and got some text back. How do I take raw text that might have um, certain indications that maybe this is a new paragraph or maybe that this is a bullet point or maybe that this should be strike through or something from those clues say why don't we format it like this why don't we spit out something that's a little nicer looking why don't we um, you know why don't we put a paragraph break here things like that and I want to be able to do that automatically because I mean ain't nobody got time to sit here and hack on every government document we want to mm -hmm. to make up in if you're a government agency who wants to do this with a hundred million such documents, you know, the your your choices are have a person go through a hundred million documents or do a hundred million documents on this computer, leave it alone for a while, and then poof, your problem is solved. Saving time, saving cost, saving some poor soul from having to look manually through each one of these documents. The, the, the longer term goal is to improve the processes of government, you know, detect fraud, waste, and abuse, provide uh, open data for, um, uh, for startups to generate economic value with, do everything that open data can do that just it's uh, um, unable to do while it's locked up in these documents.